لا شك انه الكثافه السكانيه بينتج عنا مشاكل لها علاقه بضيق المسافات وتضخم بانتاج السيارات وصعوبه ايجاد مواقف لها يلا باركينج فكره بتساعد لايجاد حل لهالمشكله من خلال تطبيق ممكن تلاقي في مواقف مناسبه لكل مناسبه I've been in Dubai for basically my whole life. I was born in the UK and then brought over by my parents. Uh, went to secondary and uh, primary and secondary school here, mm -hmm. and then went to the UK for a university, um, and then came back to try and get a job, and then uh, and eventually start Yellow Parking. What is different about Yellow Parking from other applications or websites? Maybe it could have the same goal. the fact that we're not from a parking background so we see everything from the consumer point of view we want to work with every parking operator so uh, we're not trying to introduce hardware we're not trying to introduce any more parking infrastructure we're just currently working with existing infrastructure and making it very very easy for our suppliers to sign up and, and start making money هل في مده معينه الواحد لازم يحطها ليستعمل يلا باركينج يعني مده قصيره ام مده طويله انتم محددينها Sure. So we actually do both at the minute. So our website, Yellow Parking, um, allows drivers to book on a monthly or yearly basis. And then our app that's currently in testing will allow drivers to find in real time uh, parking for an hourly or daily use. ومين بحدد التسعيرة؟ هل أنتو أم صاحب الباركينج؟ وهل دفع بيكون يومي أم على عدد الساعات أم شهري خلينا نقول؟ We produce guides for different areas and, and what we think that they could charge um, based on previous previous data. But we, we do leave it up to the suppliers so they can set uh, an hourly rate, a daily rate, a monthly rate and a yearly rate. Craig, you and Harry, in this stage that you gave us, what are the challenges that you have faced? In the early stages, and it was just trying to get that initial traction to say, right, we have a, a very good business idea here, um, and we just have to really, really work hard to try and, uh, to try and get some suppliers on and, and get it out there to, to, the, to the drivers. So it's uh, starting from nothing and trying to create something is the hardest part. لكن هاري كيف بيشتغل الويبسايت؟ إذا أنا حابة هلا أحجز باركينج لإلي، كيف بقدر فوت على الويبسايت وأحجز؟ So uh, when a user lands on the website, um, the first thing they do is to register an account. Um, so they just click this button in the top right hand corner. Okay. Uh, you can register pretty easily with uh, Facebook mm -hmm. or you can just add your details in here um, and then click register and that will create an account for you. Okay. So once you've created an account, um, then it's uh, as simple as adding your car details into your profile. Mm -hmm. um, so you just add the vehicle you drive. This person is driving a nice Porsche, <laughs> the right. plate number and the model. and the uh, color of the car. Uh, then you add that in, you press update here, okay? Uh, then you'd need to go and search for a car parking space in the area you want to find a spot. So whether it's near your home or your office. Um, one area that's really popular for Yala parking is in Business Bay, where there's lots of offices. So it's as simple as just searching the area, uh, clicking down in the drop down, and then just hitting search. We find that most of our users are looking for an open-ended open booking uh, and they want it to start immediately. So uh, this shows you all of the spaces we have available in, in the area and this is in Business Bay. Uh, then you click on the tower that's closest to you. Um, we'll use Burlington Tower as an example. Uh, then you can click uh, on more information which basically allows you to see a bit more info about how much it's going to cost per month or per year uh, and any information about the building that you might need. Um, from this screen here, you can see that uh, it's available f until, uh, until indefinite, so it's open-ended. Um, the building requires an access card, and if it requires an access card, then Yellow Parking will um, deliver that to you within 24 hours of your booking. Hello. Quite similar to ordering something from the internet. Um, you can see here, you can uh, go for the monthly option and pay 400 euros per month, uh, and then the prices get a little bit more reduced as you book for longer. For with lot discounts, users. Yeah, to offer you a bit of an incentive if you wanted to book for 12 months. Okay. And in this point, you'd uh, add the dates in you want to book for. Uh, we'll go for Wednesday, okay. and we'll book for a month until. Okay. Then you click the car that you've added in, and then select your payment method. We'll go with credit card here, uh, and then book the space. This is just uh, the high-level details of the space, so you can see what you've entered, um, the duration, uh, any uh, other costs included, like the delivery fee or the VAT. Uh, and then you click confirm if it's all correct. And then that booking is made. 
Um, so that will be approved by the owner and then we'll send you a, a credit card link to pay and uh, the access card will be delivered to you within 24 hours. Okay, and that's the parking for you. وبعد ما وصلتوا لهيدا اللي وصلتوا له اليوم وين بتشوفوا يلا باركينج بالمستقبل القريب وبالمستقبل البعيد In the near future we want to be regarded as the Middle Eastern parking platform so that's anything from airport parking uh, event parking uh, long term parking at your house or your office um, and then you know it's a one one platform for all your parking needs in the future i think there's a really interesting kind of discussion around autonomous vehicles and and what they're going to do with their with their data so if you look at our industry um, parking is very much a, an important player in how cars get around where they're stored um, so i think in 10 years time or even 15 years time where autonomous vehicles or, or or self-driving vehicles start to become mainstream, the data around parking will be, will be vital to, you know, how they operate. في كثير اشخاص كمان عندهم افكار بس بعدهم يمكن ما تشجعوا يبدوا افكارهم لحتى ياسسوا شركتهم الخاصه، فشو النصيحه اللي بتعطيهم اياها؟ Main piece of advice would be to find a co-founder, um, someone that you trust and someone that you can relate to. Uh, it's very very difficult doing it on your own um, and having two brains instead of one really really helps even just in the idea phase and then actually going out and getting the work done and, and growing the company quickly. Um, another would be to, to validate your idea before you take it to market. So, you know, try and find 50 people that you think struggle with the problem that you're trying to solve and then go and get their feedback on the best way to solve it. Dubai is kind of seen as a, a regional hub for, for innovation and, um, and it kind of makes just a lot of sense to be here. شكرا لك جريج وان شاء الله من نجاح لنجاح شكرا مش قليل المواقف اللي منواجهها خلال حياتنا بشكل يومي بس من المواقف اللي منفتش عليها هي موقف لا سيارتنا بس نكون خارج نطاق العمل او البيت يلا باركينج بيساعدنا على ايجاد الموقف المناسب بالمكان المناسب